Hi everyone. Um, in this video, we are going to discuss about the difference between selenium and QTP. So by knowing the difference between selenium and QTP, so it will help you in choosing the tool. So the first one is selenium can be used in Windows, Mac and Linux, whereas QTP can only be used in Windows. And coming to second point, it's a open source tool and it is completely free. Anyone can freely use this Selenium tool. So whereas QTP is a license to us and it will apply the cost per user, there will be a cost charged. And the third point is it is supports multiple programming languages. In our previous video, we already seen the programming language supported. For example, it supports C Sharp, Java, JavaScript, Objective-C, Perl, PHP, Python, and Ruby. Whereas QTP supports only VBScript. Okay. So to use the QTP, one has to know VBScript. Without knowing the VBScript, it is difficult to uh, start learning the QTP. And coming to Selenium, it supports multiple browsers. Okay. So it supports Firefox, IE, Safari, Chrome, Opera. Okay. Whereas QTP supports limited browsers such as IE and Firefox. And coming to Selenium, Selenium test can be developed using any available IDE. There are so many open source available, uh, so many open source uh, IDEs available such as Eclipse, NetBeans and Visual, Visual Studio. You can use any of these studios or IDEs can, and using that you can develop Selenium test code. Whereas QTP test can be developed by using only QTP IDs and it cannot support other IDs. It cannot support third party IDs. And coming to uh, Selenium, it has no official support since it is a open source. Okay, you cannot export uh, no, support from the Selenium community, uh, Selenium directly. Okay, so because it is a open source, so you can uh, you can get the support from only from the forums. Okay, not directly from the people who works in selenium okay so whereas uh, qtp as a licensed version is a licensed version okay so there are uh, dedicatedly some person will be available to support you okay there is a technical support available and coming to selenium uh, with the new you know with the new selenium releases the api sometimes changes okay whenever a selenium release a new uh, new tool okay so there is a chance that the previous APS might get changed okay so in that case so your previous code required to upgrade it so the code which is already written so when you migrate to the new version of selenium sometimes it is required to update your code okay whereas QTP supports completely backward compatibility okay so when you take the new version of QTP you no need to change your test code because it supports backward compatibility one example is that it supports the latest qtp release supports the code which is written in five years back okay yeah that's it thank you